Hey guys, so today we are going to be filming a video talking about the first time getting a professional bra fitting. So Abby's going to be our customer today. I'm going to be her fitter. I'm going to give her the full fit as if she hadn't been here before. So we'll start with our measure. We'll check some fits along the way. And you guys are also going to pop into the stock room with me to kind of see the process of how we choose bras and why we choose certain products to bring you while you're in your fitting room. So we're going to get started. We're going to have Abby tape her top off and we'll start with her measure. Perfect. So we do have a fitting room available if you'd just like to follow me this way. So this will be much better. We'll grab right. the 36. So we're just going to be down in room three today and I'll have Maddie working with you. So for your measurement, it'll just be your top off and your current bra on, okay? Perfect. Thank you. You're welcome. And then if you give Maddie just one minute, she'll be right with you, okay? Awesome. Thanks. Yes. Perfect. You need a measure today, right? Yes, please. Okay. Can we talk to you before? No, this is actually my first time. Okay, awesome. We'll take two quick measures, pop it over. Looking for anything in particular today? <laughs> no, just kind of seeing what um, options I have. Okay, awesome. Open to different styles. You'll have way more options. Oh, you're so good. So two quick measures. Um, first measure shows us your band size. Second, you measure the full part of your top. We can't tell the difference. We bring one for size to get you started, okay? Sounds good. Thank you. Back. So we just measured Abby, she measures bang on a 36H. So we go to our 36H section. We're gonna usually start in a neutral unless my customer says otherwise. Um, I like this guy. This is Prima Donna Madison. Fits pretty true to size, uh, band and cup. So we're gonna see how it goes. Sometimes it needs to be adjusted. Not perfect the first time, totally fine. Let's pop it on her and see mm -hmm. how it is. Hey Abby, are you ready for me? You got something on? Yes, I am. Awesome, can we take a look? Sure. Let's see, let's see. Oh, that's not bad. How do you feel? Not bad. Not bad. Okay, let's take like your band first. Keep it for me here. Awesome. Okay, so you've got yourself done up in the middle. Not bad. We do start on the loosest side of hooks normally though. Okay. It gives you somewhere to go. And this is as tight as your bra is ever going to be. So we want to make sure that you get the full lifespan out of your product here. Okay. Okay, so loosest set of hooks. Does that feel a little better? Mm -hmm. More breathing room? Definitely. Awesome. Turn around. Let's check your cup. Oh, not bad at all. So we'll go ahead and adjust you on the side. Is it okay to reach into your cup? Yep. Perfect. Rest tissue to the front wire back. Brings all your volume out from under your arms and towards the center here. We'll do the same on the other side. Let's get you forward. We also pull that wire up a little bit. You want to make sure that it's sitting right at the base where you're attached between your ribcage and your breast. Okay, give it a little push. Not bad. Style was not totally perfect. Ideally, this is going to be flush to your chest. It is twisting a little bit. Okay. But size wise, looks pretty good. That means wire to wire, and that's actually sitting in a nice spot. So we'll bring some options, different styles, and we'll see what you like, okay? Sounds good. Thank awesome. you. Okay, so um, her first bra was pretty good. Based on um, size, looks really good. We're gonna choose something maybe a little bit deeper in the cups, just so that wire sits a little bit more flush. Uh, which means we are probably gonna switch brands. So she didn't have a color preference. We are gonna start with something like this. Um, I usually choose options that I know, in Abby's case, is gonna sit flush in the center of her chest because that's really what we had a hard time with that first time. So we'll bring a few different brands, get a sense for what she likes. This is a great. This is even metallic. This will definitely be flush, but it is a little bit snugger. So. We'll start in a 36, we may end up in a 38. Totally fine. I typically don't adjust sizes until I've seen it on my customer. We don't know how to adjust if we don't put it on. Um, we'll bring something in that brand, that Sculptress might be really comfy in the center. And we're gonna bring one in this. This is a very full cup, but has a tendency to fit deep at the bottom. So this should sit flush as well. We'll go over some options to get her started. Um, we'll go ahead and drop this off for her now. Yeah. All right, Abby. We've got some options for the HS style like these should all be a little bit more flush in the center. Um, pop one on. We'll keep checking your fits as we go. Let me know when you're ready for me. If you need any help at all? I'm right outside. All right, so Maddie gave me a few options here, so I'm just going to pick one that I think I would like, and she can come in and check the fit. All right, Maddie, I got one on. Perfect. Can I pop in for you? Yes. Awesome. Oh, this is already better in the center. So I'm just going to pop this aside here. So we check your band again. Again, don't forget, loose a set of hooks back here, okay? Right. Get lots of lace band. If you spend all this money on a bra, we want you to make sure that it lasts you. There you go. So this is a little bit stretchy. How does it feel through the band right here? Comfortable? Yes. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Well, a little bit stretchy, so not to be surprised. Let's turn around and check your cup. It's much better already. Already we can tell this is a little bit more flush. So we'll go ahead and do our adjusting. Remember, breast tissue forward, wire to the back much better. So this could have been a style issue from the first brand. It could just be that Alomi is a little bit bigger in the cup than Primadonna, so you have a little bit more, more coverage. This is beautiful on you. How do your straps feel? 
Okay, I think. Straps are about comfort. So do you feel like you want a little more? Be a little here, just on this one side? Yeah. Now ideally, I'd probably recommend going down in this band size. This looks like you've got a lot of room. If you can see already, it's pulling itself up your back. So once you have more of the kind of the fist work you've got, and we've got a couple here, you can see in the mirror. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna bring this back in a 34 band and you're gonna feel a lot more secure right there in the back, okay? okay? So we have Abby in the 36H in that purple Alomi Morgan. Band is a little bit fake, so we need to put her in a 34 band. However, if we put her in the 34H, the cup will then be too small. So we go up to the next cup size and down to the um, desired band size. So we end up with a 34 double H. Um, purple. End of the section. Perfect. So this will keep the cup the same as we first saw her in it, and it looked great. It was nice and ta uh, tacked in the center. All her best issue was in front but the band will be a little snugger this time, so a little more comfortable. Okay, Abby, so this is the very first one we really liked in the purple where the cup was really great. Um, this is the adjusted band size, so go ahead and pop it on and we'll take a look at your fit when you're all ready. Band size. Perfect. All right, I have the next, or the other one on, I guess. <laughs> Perfect, so smaller in the band. Let's take a look here. Okay. The cup still looks good, to be expected. How does the band feel? Better. Better, right? Mm -hmm. Everyone thinks looser bands are more comfortable. What happens is you end up relying so much on your straps. You get those little divots and you just get that awful kind of neck pain up here. So snug band, always better. This definitely looks looks great. Turn around, let's check your cup before you take it home. of things. Mm -hmm. This looks beautiful. You're going to get a great six to nine months worth of wear out of that. Make sure your hands washing and lean flat to dry all the good stuff, but fit wise looks great. Okay. All right. Perfect. I'm here if you need anything else from me. Okay, Abby? All right. Thank you so much. All right. I have the next one on. Perfect. Are you ready for me? Yeah. Okay. Oh, a little bit big in the cup, but not bad. Hey? Yeah. No, okay. So we check our band first. A little bit snugger, hey? Yeah. Still feel comfortable though? Yeah. It's okay, snug but manageable, hey? Definitely. Perfect. And this time we've got about one fist for us, so we don't need to adjust that band size. As long as you're good through the band, we're good. We'll leave that. Turn around, let's check your cup. Nothing that we can't adjust into. So again, rest tissue to the center and wire backward. You want to be a little bit, a little bit firm. Doesn't always want to move on you. <laughs> Better. You may want to go down half a size. You do have a teeny bit of extra space here or something. We can talk about it. This was going to be your winner. Mm -hmm. But so far, so good. I like that one too. Cool. Okay, I have the next one on. Perfect. Can I pop in for you? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, maybe another good option here. How do you feel in this one? Pretty good. The Thank wire you. definitely feels a little bit more firm. Under your arms? Yeah. Normal for this brand. Your band looks really good. Give it a little tug. So once we've adjusted you, turn it out the front for me. Once you've adjusted your breast tissue out from under your arms, sometimes that helps. It could just be that that wire is pressing on something soft. Okay, so don't don't be afraid to kind of pull things forward. Come on this side. Does that feel a little better mm -hmm. already, right? Because when you move it backward, you keep all of that soft breast tissue in the front. This looks great. Let's take a look at your straps. They actually look okay. They don't even really need much adjusting. I really like this on you. Um, I would pop your top on. Take a look at the shape. Everything looks different under your clothes. definitely see the seams in this one though so I don't know how I feel about that but hey Abby just checking in how's it going um pretty good you can come in it on? Yeah. oh this looks good under our shirt hey yeah not bad it's a little yeah. bit of the seams mm. though normal normal so let's talk about seams really quick okay everyone thinks round and lifted means molded but the thing with the molded cup is that it's pre-shaped over someone else's breast so that foam gets heat sealed on a different shape so what happens is you get that emptiness at the top of the cup and actually what happens is these seams in these cut and sewn bras that's where your lift and support is coming from so this vertical seam is going to redirect your breast tissue upward and if you turn to the side here oh perfect the side works too this side panel right through here that side seam is what's bringing you all that volume to the front so you have that nice forward and lifted look most people aren't super worried about a seam. You could wear um, a cami underneath something if you were really worried about it. And I mean, this is a super sheer top too. So totally. keep in mind, won't be so bad under a cotton. 
Um, but yeah, seams are seems where it's at. Lift, support, and it's giving you that really beautiful shape. Perfect. I wouldn't let it discourage you. It's okay. a great fit, okay? All right. Thank Perfect. you so much. I'm right here if you need me. All right. So I think that I like this one the best. Um, Shape-wise, it looks really, really good from the side and the front. Um, I know that there's the seams there, but honestly, it's no big deal. I'd rather have a great fitting bra than worry about things falling out. So I think I'm going to go with this one and yeah all right everyone so as you can see getting a fit is not too bad at all um really easy process and now i know i can pop in here and get fitted for a sports bra or a swimsuit or just some more bras um whenever i need some so yeah